Hello students, sometimes visualization makes mathematical complexity easier and simpler to understand with the help of daily life utensils. Today we shall perform an activity to find out volume of combination of solids. To perform this activity we will require some materials like two right circular cylinders of equal radius and height, four hemispheres of equal radii, some colored papers, a pair of scissors, adhesive, marker and a ruler. Now, we have here a combination of solids, a right circular cylinder with two hemispheres fixed at the ends of the right circular cylinder. Here we have taken the height of right circular cylinder as 34 centimeters and radius of the hemisphere as 7 upon 2 centimeters. In order to calculate the volume of combination of such a solid, we will add the volume of right circular cylinder and volumes of two hemispheres attached at the ends. We know the volume of right circular cylinder is pi r square h and volume of hemisphere is 2 upon 3 pi r cube. So, we add the volumes as pi r square h plus 2 into 2 upon 3 pi r cube. Here, the height of the right circular cylinder is 34 centimeters and radius is 7 upon 2 centimeters. On substituting the values, we get pi r square h plus 2 into 2 upon 3 pi r cube that is equal to 22 upon 7 into 7 upon 2 into 7 upon 2 into 34 plus 4 upon 3 into 22 upon 7 into 7 upon 2 into 7 upon 2 into 7 upon 2 centimeter cube. Now, by taking 22 upon 7 into 7 upon 2 into 7 upon 2 as common, we have 34 plus 4 upon 3 into 7 upon 2 inside the brackets. So, on solving this we get 77 upon 2 into 34 plus 14 upon 3 centimeter cube, which on further solving gives us 77 upon 2 into 102 plus 14 upon 3 centimeter cube. On further simplification, we get 77 into 58 upon 3 centimeter cube that gives us 4466 upon 3 centimeter cube. On division, we get volume of the solid as 1488.67 centimeter cube. Now, let us take another combination of solids in which we have a right circular cylinder and two hemispheres fixed inside the cylinder. Here, how will we calculate the volume? We will take volume of right circular cylinder and subtract the volumes of two hemispheres attached at the ends of the right circular cylinder. So, what will be the volume? Volume of right circular cylinder is pi r square h minus 2 into 2 upon 3 pi r cube that gives us pi r square taking common h minus 4 upon 3 r. On substituting the values, height we had taken at 34 centimeters and radius of cylinder was 7 upon 2 centimeters. On substituting the values, we have 22 upon 7 into 7 upon 2 into 7 upon 2 into 34 minus 4 upon 3 into 7 upon 2 centimeter cube, which on simplification gives us 77 upon 2 into 34 minus 14 upon 3 centimeter cube. That further on simplification gives us 77 upon 2 into 102 minus 14 upon 3 centimeter cube. That gives 77 upon 2 into 88 upon 3 centimeter cubes, which on simplification gives us 3388 upon 3 centimeter cube. On division, we get the volume as 1129.33 centimeter cube. 
So, students we saw that while calculate the volume of combination of solids in both the cases, we had seen that the volume had decreased in this case, right. Now, I have a question for you. Can you guess what will be the total surface area in both the cases? So, students, it is interesting to note that the volumes here were different, but total surface area of both the combination of solids remains the same. Thank you.